So I heard about this and I don't know if it works. So I want to try it. Apparently this ghost tracker gun screen that I am going to buy from the paranormal bundle will allow you to get free souls. All right, so here is the gun screen. Flip my gun over, there it is. See that little soul icon there on the gun screen in this one? Ooh. Oh yeah, I also switched over to throwing knives because I was doing some uh, lockdown yesterday. And yeah, there was a lot more souls in that mode as well. That seemed a lot better to play it. Does this pay to win? Boom! Oh, look at that! Look at him come! Oh, jeez! See? The souls come right to me! Oh, you're not getting away that easy, friendo. Unless he got killed from this guy, but I would have got an assist if he did. See? I told you guys that's pretty cool, right? I saw it and I was like, oh, I gotta do this. I gotta show this to you guys. It was right I did a video on it. They just come right to... I don't know why this one didn't. Maybe he just looted it. It was on the ground still. Right. Oh, guy parachuting over there. But we know we had one in this building earlier. Come to me, souls. That's kind of nice. That's kind of nice. Strange. They know how to get you to pay the money, huh? Usually this is where the people like to snipe. TV, some people do like to go up on, but it's still weak to the top roof up there, so. Enemies deployed a counter UAV. Counter UAV, look at that. Best thing to do would be to take the redeploy over here up. It's, you see this, this blue gun screen? It's the guy, it's like the FBI looking guy. I almost bought that one just because I liked it, but then I was like, eh. And then I saw Ryder's video and I was like, all right, I'm getting it. It lags so... I can't even play. I can't even play. It's broken. Plating's broken, too. I got sniped, like, right when I landed. Yeah, look. I still have plates on. It's bugged. That might be a bug with this gun screen. Oh, come on. There we go, there we go. Come to me, souls. I'm pretty good at this game, guys. Oh, that sucks. Not for me, though. Bye-bye. See? <laughs> Last time, it just... It's so weird what happened here. I, I can't explain it. Hello? Cracked you first shot? <laughs> Starting to think I'm a little better than you. SPX, high velocity sniper, dude. That'll do it. Let me see this thing. Yep. Requesting recon at my location. It's a bold move to play. It, it, it's a bold move there. Shots down at Skate Park there. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I just chose this guy to win. Looked like he was down, you know? Looked like he was down bad. And it looked like kind of a default skin, so I was like, maybe that guy's worse. Let's help out the other. Let's help out that guy. I want the worst person to win. That's a mistake. Now what are you going to do? You got to repair both your tires. This is where I kind of wish I had uh, some type of uh, assault rifle, I will say. Not above saying that. Let's hope he's a bad sniper, but that guy looks kind of cracked. Doesn't have high velocity rounds, it does appear. 
So we make the rotation onto high, and we get another PA off of the guy that we sniped earlier. Sick. Although, he didn't full die out, did he? Yeah, this guy down here is the biggest threat of the lobby. There's no question about it. We take this guy, we win the game. And we didn't take him, so now we're kind of screwed. Although, hold up. We got some action off the top ropes here. Near your location. Told you guys. Your squad is in the top five. Let's get it done. Enemy position airstrike. Find cover. I don't know if this is the right call, but. Shots missed. No joy. Closing round. I think he rotated down low. I want to use the other guy to help me kill this guy, though. so hard should we do post game breakdown on that one too i feel like we might as well so i did lose some of my utility when i was on the roof i jumped off roof because i got pushed off by the group zones pulling extremely far and i obviously have to run out of the building to even or run through the gas to even get out of the building here I tried to call the airstrike. I, I was thinking maybe there was a way up here, but it's on the other side and it would take too long for me to go up there and challenging him out of gas did not seem like the right play. So I tried to just make the cross where zone's going. Edge of this building is in on the top part here. Of course, it's weak to the roof. I need to get him off the roof. Maybe he jumps off and goes for the early dive, but it was a little early to dive all the way over for the gas mask when I called that initial precision airstrike in. Most likely, he burns his gas mask, though, staying up high. This guy caught me off guard. My high alert saved my ass. But fortunately, the MP7 shredded as well. And at this point, I'm just checking to make sure if he's still up there because I've got the early position. He is going to be forced off, probably already burnt his gas mask if he is still up there, to avoid the precision airstrike. Um, there is a spot under the stairs you can hide, and I just, I keep missing the headshots on this guy. This is probably like an 80 meter shot, so I don't think I even needed to put any drop on it, and I may, it was probably just a torso, but I landed the first shot. I go for the shots. Unfortunately, I didn't have the reload on this because I am running the 40 rounder. I don't think I kill him anyways. We at least went for it. We had to go for it, see if we could follow up and get the MP7 kill. I also got high alerted from the left, so I know there's one there, and these are the top three players. That's it. So now I, I know where everybody is. I don't need a UAV. V. The fact that I even have a stealth vest, I was thinking of switching over for the reinforce at the end there. Could have been a play, but at, at that point, at this late of the game, loot's not going to make the difference. It's going to be the kills, you know, unless there's a gas mask, which I didn't see one on this guy when I first checked him. I'm looking now. I don't see one. So that could have been a misplay if I didn't pick up a gas mask off of him because obviously mine's popped. And that's what exactly I was trying to do. I, I wasn't even going to try and shoot that guy because if he's alive and he's as bad as he is, which clearly seems like it, he could be a distraction to open up for an opportunity for me to kill the other guy or to know where he is. Now, I didn't know what happened there, but I believe the guy up top jumped down low on his side and then went around my building to get in because I did hear some coughing underneath me. I'll see if I can play it and you guys could hear it. 
You hear the coughing on the left side there. It's very faint. You hear two coughs, and it sounds like it's down low on the left here. I wasn't sure if maybe he had even dipped here, but I feel like I would have seen him and heard him coming in if he I did go he high. Down low. So I think he jumped off and waited for the last second to pull his parachute and go low. Then I hear him in the grass right below me here, so other... I know he's there, but you can see the other guy's the now guy starting to shoot me. I'm not going to shoot though. at the other guy because I need to kill the threat first. And, of course, you see Kilfi drops. You hear the shots on the left. There was a one-way gunfire. He instantly just beamed that guy to death. He killed him. Now, this is the bad part. The longer I wait to get down, the worse of a position that I am in. Uh, I get a couple shots on. If I could soften him enough, I could try and dive on him. But I'm so high up that I'm likely going to have to pull my parachute to avoid taking more damage, which sucks even worse. I try and see if I can get a lucky Semtex when he's running out. Maybe force him underneath so he doesn't shoot at me when I jump down. At this point, I'm kind of panicking. But fortunately, I do have the ledge here. So I pull my chute to land here. Because if I pull my chute down to the bottom, he kills me in that animation easily. So I was very fortunate that there was a ledge here to at least get me down low. But of course, I can't plate and I can't heal in gas. And if I come into zone, he wins. Like, he's got me on the hold. I have no health here, dude. He kills me so easily. I need to get a reload off. I need to replate, which I can't because I don't have a gas mask. So I just need to keep the pressure, make him think that I'm in a good position is what I was at least hoping to do. Of course, he could still just turn and kill me. It looks like he's throwing his Semtex up to get me off of it, but me jumping down in the gas catches him off guard. He's still in the animation of throwing the Semtex, which is great for me. I get a couple shots on. He now goes defensive thinking, maybe I do have a full mag. Maybe I did get my reload. He doesn't know I'm in as bad of a position as I am, sure enough. Uh, I end up getting knocked from zone because I keep playing the gas as long as I did. He didn't realize it goes for the replate during that time. My bluff paid off. And I'm going to get the self res, which he'll then hear and immediately try and push because he's going to know I don't have any plates. And now I'm ultra screwed. So, and especially because he heard me coughing, he knows I'm not going to have plates because I can't plate anyways. That will trigger the health regen for a second. Get the smoke down immediately. And into the bush I go where I cannot be seen plated up. He's jumping around trying to catch me on a you know, a sweat ass move where I'm going to jump out and go for a spray and try and take him down. Little does he know I'm getting a full replay, which is going to win me the fight. Full magazine now locked in. I'm locked and cocked, baby. Of course he is too. He's in zone. He spent that time while I was self resing ready to go. And my health is still regenning. I don't have a, a med vest on nor quick fix, obviously. So he starts going for some spray. I just try and hip fire spray, get a couple connections. I now know where he is and I go for a jump to try and stay mobile. But of course, on controller, he hits every single shot. At least that's what I would assume here because this dude has been absolutely frying. Close range is the weakest part of mouse player's game. And I just got lucky enough that I got right into his belly button. That's clearly see-through there, but I got him, dude. I'm so happy. That's... Oh, man. That's uh, that's great. That's great. I'm glad you guys are here to join the, join with me on that win there because I've lost like every game for the last but probably over a week in solos. All right, there it is. Give it a like if you enjoyed a little of the post-game breakdown as well for me. And uh, thanks so much for watching.